Soldiers of the U.S. Infantry have many nicknames. The Queen of Battle, Doughboy, Gravel Pounder. But the most familiar term for the infantrymen with dog tags is dogface. This dogface is Combat Sergeant Rock, squad leader. First squad, first platoon, Company I. Anything? Uh uh. Boy, I sure missed Hal Jeeves. Mm hmm. What's the next Casbah called? What's the difference? I like to keep the name straight of every village we take. It's City Bouquet. And we're not taking it, Gibby. We're just gonna draw a little fire to learn their strength. But you can silver star yourself in the Bouquet if you want to. I'll, uh. Have the old man hang a gong on you posthumously. You're gonna wear that thing out. You're a sore loser, Layton. What do you mean? You've been sweating me out ever since I won this watch from you. Perpetual motion, Sergeant. You don't have to wind it. Ah, you don't have to tell me that. has located the enemy. Siegfried has located the enemy. Siegfried has located the enemy. Alert all guns. Mission coming up. Siegfried has located the enemy. Thanks to infantry. I cannot see. Where is the dog now? Approximately 100 feet from summit to forward slope of hill 510. Siegfried is preparing to point. Siegfried is preparing to point.
485-308. Pointing west-northwest, 355 degrees. From direction he is pointing, enemy appears to be headed toward Sidi Bukhev. Fire direction center. Fire mission. Number four gun. Number three troop. Number one battery. Shell white smoke. Fuse quick. Lane says he saw somebody up there. Late. Where'd you see him? On top of that hill. Looked like an Arab. That's just a dog. Battery adjust. Left two five zero. Two zero zero right. my replacements, Kalowitz. Well, let's see now. The four men, I put it down in black and white. And there they are. Lead and make it? No, nope. we put them in a mattress cover about an hour ago. Rough. Yeah, it took me a long time to break him in. Layton? Mm-hmm. It's perpetual motion, Sarge. You don't have to wind it. Oh, you don't have to tell me. Take one man, Rock. One, I lost four men in that shelling. Well, your squad's not the only one hurting. Where's the lieutenant? Who do you think's tossing this platoon when I give an order? It's like the lieutenant speaking. Like the lieutenant and being the lieutenant. That's two different things. Where is he? He's back of battalion, and he said you were lucky to get even one guy the way they've been coming in for the Reppel Depot. Does the lieutenant want me to take another crack at reconning Bukhev? Oh, you stay out of that town. It's crawling with Krauts out of Ronald's 10th SS Panzer. Meantime, I'm going to look around for some water. I need a bath. You, let's go. In the meantime, you're going to take whatever's left of your squad and hunt down that dog. What dog? A dog that's been spotting for the Krauts. You kidding? That's what I said when I heard the tale. But after half a C Company got clobbered on Stuka Road, the story began to gel. Who told you that? The lieutenant and the captain. The old man was here? Yeah, also the exec from regiment. Four of our tanks got knocked out of Jebel Wadi, and the tank CEO personally saw that dog pointing at him, just like a hunting dog. A dog pinpointing us for artillery? It's on the level. We got the official dope from a couple of PWs. Everybody in the Usasha Valley's been on the alert to kill that animal. I joined up to shoot people. I can't shoot no dog. Look, you see that hound, you'll shoot him and like it. Now, me, Sergeant, I ain't blaming no canine for that shellacking we got. Then who do you think directed those 88s at us? I don't have to think, Sergeant. I know that lieutenant's pulling your leg. He gave us the job to find and kill that animal. Can they court-martial me if I don't shoot him? Now, look, Gibby. I don't want any more beefing out of you. Nobody. And that goes for the general, too. Can make me shoot no dog. Can any of you guys shoot a dog? Not me. Are you kidding? Count me out. You see, Sergeant, none of us swallows that story. 
You'll have to line the whole squad up against the firing wall. Medic! Hey, Medic, call that casually. Come on, you jokers. You too, Gibby. The front, Sergeant? No, I just hold it up a minute. The gates. Drunken. I speak English good also. You're lucky. Peter? De Gleek. You. Oh, yeah, I understand. For you, the Krieg's over. Kaput. I uh, hear you're going to America. Yeah? Sure, maybe even California. They got prison camps there near Hollywood. Yeah? Yeah, well, you'll get to see cinema stars, girls in bikinis, cowboys. You get to see how they train horses and dogs to act. They've got the smartest dog school in the world in Hollywood. Which one's got the best? The smartest dogs in the world. Can a Hollywood dog pick up the scent of the enemy, then run forth and back ten times to attract the attention of an observer? <laughs> Smart? Since a puppy is trained to the sound of shells going over his head. Uh, I still don't buy it. Right here, Nusseltia Valley is Siegfried, our number one dog. He's the smartest dog in the world. And he will be the dead of all of you swiney horns. Any of you jokers still on that SPCA soapbox? I don't want to hear any more of that. Man's best friend, I wash. That dog's got to be killed. I don't want to hear any one of you seen him and you hadn't blown his head off. Just remember, you're not killing a dog, you're killing the enemy. We do spot him when you take the first shot. With pleasure. Didn't you ever own no dog? Yeah. The only pet I ever had was a 19 year old boy. Well, that's one thing about a dog. Huh? You treat him right and his whole world gets wrapped up in you. No girl can give you that kind of loyalty. Ah, uh, you meathead. When I'm with a baby... It's not loyalty I'm looking for. Hey. Matt, the minute I thought I spotted him. The whole company really out on this hunt? Sure, the old man's got 30 patrols gunning for him. That CV kind of makes me think how I miss teaching my home fancy tricks. Kind of much you got? French poodle. Ooh la la. No cracks. <laughs> oh, he's smart, all right, but nothing like this canine we're looking for. It's a shame. What is? It's a downright shame. What are you talking about? Well, he don't know he's being used to kill us, does he? <laughs> Who cares? I hope he's back to me if I have to shoot him. Would you shoot Hitler? You kidding? Think of Hitler when you see that dog. Holy smoke. What's the matter? See those rocks? Yeah. No. Over there. Yeah, yeah, I see them. There they are, the same rocks flanking the West Road in the Bouquet. The cross were not done, we'd be dead now.
of mine. We can both stand a spray. I've had mine. Then haul back and tell Sergeant Collowitz's boot cap's clean. I'll hold up here. Why? Why? How long you been in my squad? One of us got to stay here in case the enemy comes back. You don't want to walk into an ambush, do you? Well, how will we know if the crowds come back? I'll send up a red flare. Then what? The battalion can bail me out. You're going to end up in a mattress cover if you stay here. You uh, sure you can find your way back to platoon, CP? I never get lost going home. Quit bawling. How'd I blow your head off, you know that. Lucky dog, the bullet went right through it, didn't hit any bone. Ah, shut up. You know how many of us you got killed? Don't worry, I'm not hurting you. Not yet. This sulfur will stop gain green unless you want to get poisoned, you bum. Go on, swallow them. Go on. Drink it all, yeah. Drink it. These sulfur pills won't do you any good unless you drink lots of water. Drink! This is only a temp dressing. I'll blow your head off later.
You and your whole family. Drop dead. <laughs> if you think I'm gonna carry you, you're nuts. Let's go. Come on. Come and see here. Come and see here. I want to tell you something. You crowds really know how to live. Look at this soap and lathers. Get back there, you meathead. I don't want that bandage washed away. Anyway, you're getting pneumonia and die on me. I'm saving you for later. Yeah, see you more careful than show. I'm gonna be browsing and cancel rooms and be wasting. Dog. The crowd dog? You got him? Yeah. Great! Wait till the old man hears this. Hey, Rock got the crowd dog. All right, let's go. Come on. Get him through the head, Sergeant? Yeah. Oh, gee, you are. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to help us produce more compelling historical content like this, please like, comment below, and share this video with fellow history buffs. And of course, be sure to subscribe to help keep history happening.